Hey, what's up you guys? It's Megan and today I thought I would make a really quick short tutorial on how to get a face cam over your videos. Now there are multiple ways to do this. I'm going to show you two of the ways that I know how to do it. Um, you know, everybody has different solutions for problems and if you guys find some other way that works for you, that's great. I just know that I get a lot of questions personally asking how I get my face cam onto my videos. And I know what you guys are thinking, wow, that's really easy, but some of you, like, I don't know why, I don't know what it is, but for some reason it doesn't click with a lot of people, and it didn't click with me at first either. Uh, it took me a second, and then I was like, wait, that's super easy. So don't worry about it, I'm going to show you how today, and first, let me just tell you, um, you're going to need two things. You're going to need an actual camera, or a phone, or a webcam. Any of that will work, any of that will be fine. I used my phone whenever I very first started making videos. Uh, but now I've moved on to this camera. So basically this is on my camera. This is not on my computer This is not on my webcam. This is on a uh, Canon Vixia RF whatever. It doesn't matter if they don't make it anymore uh, So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your video then you're gonna take it off the SD card and You're gonna put in the computer and now we're gonna go to my computer's screenshot mode Hold tight. We're gonna I'll meet you there. Okay, so here we are back in the video mode So basically what you're gonna do is file. I don't know what you guys use. Okay, sorry but the concept is the same, I won't go into technicals. So, import media, and then you pick your two items. I recorded this gameplay like five seconds before this, so you just drag them in, insert video track, and then you put your video on top. Like, look at that really cute screenshot. That is so cute. Oh, that's another cute screenshot. I'm like, I look really good when I play games. So you're gonna change the position of, you know, your video. I don't know what you're gonna be using. So, for example, if you're using Sony Vegas, there's this little window right here at the end of whatever video track you're using. So you can scroll over here, scroll out with your mouse, and then move this like this. Whoa! Put it anywhere you want. So, once you place it somewhere that you think looks okay, you can just click the X. And then, what I usually do is I go to Video FX, and then Cookie Cutter, and then I drag the default one over this little panel area, like so, and bring this out. As you can see, it cuts like a circle or whatever you want. So that's the first way, and then um, these aren't going to be in sync at all. Oh, and see, okay, this is also what I do, which helps me align things, is I do a clap test. So you see I'm clapping in the video. I haven't started clapping here in this thing yet, but you can see my three little tick marks right there. So I'm going to cut this, drag this over here, and you're going to align it so that those look good. So then you don't have to use this audio. This is only if you have a, like a mic. If you don't have a mic, just use your camera audio. But this is what I do because I have a mic. And then it makes the audio sound alright. Hey, what's up you guys? It's Megan, and today I'm playing a game that was emailed to me. Yeah, so that's the first way I know how to do it. So the second way I know how to do it is if you have OBS, you can click add. I know this is really confusing. I'm so sorry. I'm the worst tutorial maker ever. But you guys keep on asking me the question, so I'm just going <laughs> to answer it. So basically what you do from this point on, once you have your OBS running, you'll have a game here, not your actual monitor capture, which you can do by adding game capture. It's really easy. Add game capture and then click OK, and then you'll be able to find a game catch art. I have all of these sticky notes open, so I'm sorry. Uh, okay. So you're going to click Add, and then Video Capture Device. Click OK, and then you're going to find, I have my Game Capture HD, but I'm going to turn it on my webcam. Let's see if you can see me. Let's see how cute I look making this video. Hi! Hi, I'm on a webcam now. So you're going to go Edit Scene, you can drag this webcam, however you want, put it in the side of your gameplay. And then you can record your gameplay like this with your webcam over your gameplay and it'll be cool. So let's see if we can pull up a game. So we're going to open up Hearthstone. It's an easy card game. Play. And then I'm going to turn off my monitor capture and my video capture device. No, that's me. Hello. Sorry. I'm sorry I left. I'm here. And we're going to turn on our game capture. Let's properties. Make sure that our game capture is on Hearthstone. Whoa, hi. So we're gonna minimize this. It is said that that wars are only oh. won upon the anvil okay. of honor. Others believe victory requires strategy. 
Welcome I'm here to, to my help. End. Okay, so this is what this will look like. Yeah, hopefully this helped. I'm sorry, the scatterbrain. Hopefully I, I'll edit it down and it'll make much more sense. But yeah, so if you guys enjoyed the tutorial, thanks. If you didn't, that's okay. It's just for the people who are asking me the questions. But I will talk to you guys later. Bye!